Hey guys, what's going on? This is Kyle Henris that you're seeing here. You've probably seen some of his Facebook ads uh, kicking around. He's become more and more popular over the last year or so. And so I thought I'd do a quick review of him and the starter course that I did, which is free, which is always good. That's the best best price to pay for something that's free, right? So Kyle Henris has basically, he was basically popped up, started to pop up in my Facebook ads maybe a year and a half ago now. And he was always talking about how he could basically make you rich. So it was always how, you know, how to turn such and such into such and such amount of money. And, you know, very quite over the top advertising, uh, which really caught my eye. And, you know, it's the whole point of this style of advertising. And so I looked into him a little bit more. I talked to a guy who went through his course. Uh, he paid about $2,000 for one of his courses. And... Looked into his training a little bit, and then I checked out the starter course uh, just a few days ago. Thought I'd share it with you, share thoughts about who this Cal Henris actually is, and if he's worth investing time and money into learning from. So, so uh, this is him. Like I said, like this is a photograph I got uh, off the internet, just him posing in his cool, cool shades, right? And so he uh, apparently was a certified financial planner before he became an online trading guru coach. A mentor and so he at least knew something about the financial world right before he started all this stuff uh, he knew a bit about trading a bit about saving that kind of stuff um, now he claims to run his own his own hedge fund hedge fund easy for me to say that um, basically he um, runs that and he has like all these courses um, fairly negative overall ratings on him he chops and changes his style a lot, so he'll go from buy side to sell side options. Uh, just kind of goes with the latest like fad. <laughs> Tries to find something that, that uh, people will jump on, uh, on his ads it looks like. It's not that his stuff doesn't have value, it seems to, but it's um, super overhyped. Uh, anyway, um, he has two companies, or at least it was one company that changed its name. So it was called done for your wealth or something like that and then it changed to next door next door trader not sure why he changed it i think at some point he says that next door trader sounds like more relatable or something <laughs> uh, but he changed it a few times apparently in the last the last few years so i'm going to call it next door trader i think you'll see it as done for your wealth or something like that i think in my friend's article here he had it as done for your wealth or Let's have a look. Done with you wealth. That's right. So my friend bought this this course. It was two thousand four hundred dollars. The Elite Investor Mastermind, uh, and then the, then he changed the name. Uh, Kyle changed the name to Next Door Trader. So this guy he teaches selling credit spreads, but also buying options. And so I was expecting really to for the the course, the starter course, to be all about selling options. But it turns out it's not. It's just about like mindset and supply and resistance, uh, supply and demand zones. Um, it was very, very basic. So the course starts off, and I'll leave a link in the description below so you can go and check it out. The course is free, but and it is very basic, but it does bring up some good points. And I think Kyle Henry's financial planning background starts to come through from the very start of the course. And he starts talking about what you could do with $3,000, for example, if you just put it into an IRA, how much would that bring in if you spent it on learning a new skill like trading also known as buy his courses <laughs> then how much could that theoretically bring you so i do like the the start i think these types of motivational kind of thinking about things like how you're using money is pretty useful and that actually if we log in this is the log into the dashboard that's actually what the first few sections are about so this is the actual course it's a video course and it, it's pretty easy to digest. I listen to the each one on two times speed though. He doesn't speak very quickly, so it's pretty easy to digest. So he talks about the old way and the new way. So the old way about getting a W-2 job and then putting into mutual funds and everything. The new way about putting it into uh, learning new skills, in particular in trading. So there's a few videos about that. It's probably a half an hour or something of like that. And then it goes into sweet spot trading, which is really a fancy name for basically supply and demand areas. Uh, I don't want to show you too much of what's in, in it, but it's really nothing particularly exciting. There are some basics and op of options here, so you'll go through like 
what's an option, what's a call, what is a put, you know, like what's intrinsic value, what's extrinsic value. It goes through all like the basics in these. So it's a very it's a very basic course. He does show think or swim quite a lot, so that's quite useful. You'll see like how to put the orders in and things. So it, it's very low level. So you're not gonna learn anything amazing here, like a new strategy really. It's all just kind of lower level stuff. And so he talks about doing, this is something that I noticed, he talks about doing example demand trade and example supply trade. So basically, basically support and resistance, right? And so I actually wrote a little article up here somewhere. Let's see if we can find it here. So I wrote this up and I, I put in the thing here that I noticed something a little odd about the examples. So yeah, he talks about, it's called sweet spot trading. Basically it's just where the supply and demand zones are. So I've written this up a little bit. I'll put a link in the description so you can come and check out some of the stuff and get a link to actually get this course for free. <laughs> and yeah, so scalping the 5 and 15 minute chart. One thing I didn't like particularly is when I watched the video about he said, okay, let's do this for real now. I noticed that it was on demand. And so we're sitting here waiting for a bounce, basically. So this would be his uh, supply zone, right? Um, or demand zone, where people like want to buy up here and there's a bounce and he said it seemed to see like he implied that it was going to be like a live trade example um, and he showed it working and what he seems to have done is just hit on demand on thinkorswim and you guys that use that know that basically you can go and find a particular bounce part and then just go back in time and let it play in real time apparent real time and then you know the trade will work out the way you want it to so it's I felt a little misled about that. It didn't mention that it was on demand, that it was a simulated trade, and that he already knew what the outcome of the of the move was going to be. And so that felt a little bit disingenuous to me. I wasn't super excited about that. It felt kind of odd. So I wrote about that a little bit. He does talk a lot about risk management, which is what you'd hope. It's quite good. Um, charting setups. He does talk about setting up Thinkorswim and interactive brokers. He talks about why most traders fail and basically says most people don't educate themselves enough. Yep. And so the whole course probably takes an hour and a half or something. I listened to it at double speed, so it didn't take me that long at all. And uh, that's what I'd recommend you do as well um, if you decide to, to log into this thing. The um, next door trader university is pitched at the end, fair enough. Uh, I don't know how much this costs. He makes it exclusive, so you have to like apply and talk to his people and see if you're a good fit type of thing. And basically, you get like a game plan from Kyle every morning and personal coaching and all this type of stuff. And so, I think overall, it was a decent little free course. Uh, it did introduce the very basic concepts of options trading and supply and demand. Um, but really, if you want anything else, you need to pay for his next door trader university. Um, it's, I don't know whether it's like, it's nothing, absolutely nothing new to me. Um, and most people that have traded for any amount of time probably won't get much from this little free course at all. But I thought it was worth bringing up. Sometimes there's people watching these that have very little options trading experience or any experience at all. And sometimes just finding these free resources can be helpful. So I'll leave a link in the description for you to check this one out. Look into Kel Henry's a little bit more and see if somebody you might want to learn from. Alright guys, talk to you soon.